Good morning once again ladies and gentlemen Welcome back to the vlog <laughs> I'm very excited today Because I'm ticking something off my bucket list I've always wanted to do this Today We're going deep sea fishing Are you excited? <laughs> oh, are you excited? <laughs> Seriously? Are you excited? Let's go! So here we go out to the deep blue sea to catch a monster fish. This is something I've always wanted to do. My grandfather was a big fisherman in his day and my dad told me so many stories about their fishing expeditions. I even saw a couple of pictures of him standing next to the monsters he caught. He passed away when I was very young though. May his soul rest in peace. Some of my friends told me that there is nothing like deep sea fishing. And to be honest, until this day, I had only been catching fish, mostly in dams where the rules were catch and release. So I never really had the opportunity to eat what I caught. I have heard that fresh fish is amazing. And I have tried fresh fish in restaurants on the coasts on some occasions that they claim is fresh. But this time, I'm going to experience it for myself. We're going to catch fish and we're going to eat it the same day. Thank you, thank you, that was so cool. So please make use of it <laughs> and uh, may I say welcome on board to everybody welcome on board 
My name is Davi. I am the skipper here for the day. Uh, we've got Vainan. Vainan is your deckhand. Vainan is your deckhand. Uh, you'll be doing all the easy work. You'll be casting the bait, sorting the tangles, <laughs> and helping with the fish. I do all the hard work. I cook for the fish. <laughs> all right, guys. We are plans. Our plans are we're going out to Bertia Bank, seven k's which it's in. We're going to troll to Bertia, troll a bit around, see if we can get some tuna, and then from there we'll go over to the bottom fishing. All right. All right. Excellent. Excellent. A bit of patience with the game fish, guys. Uh, one minute it's uh, quiet, quiet. The next moment it's actually. Chaos here at the back. <laughs> Alright, so a bit of patience with the game fish. It's not immediate, but uh, at any, any moment, any time, we can get strikes. So be prepared. Vainan will explain to you how the rods work. Please pay close attention to what he says and do what he says as soon as the fish hits. But everybody's safe. Alright. Alright, thanks. Excellent, guys. Enjoy the day. Thank you very much. Thank you. Go, fishy, fishy. <laughs> This is an incredible view from here. That's a nice eye. Pity now that it's like cloudy and like it's on there. At this point, things started getting interesting on the boat. The good news is that we got our first strike and my son had the honor of reeling in the first bite on one of the lines that hit and he reeled in the first catch of the day. It just so happened to be a very nice little tuna. The bad news is that I managed to set up the camera but unfortunately I did not hit the record button. I regret making that mistake because that moment was absolutely epic. That tuna put up a good fight. He was reeling and reeling and reeling and that tuna was wild. Even after getting it on board, that, that thing was still flipping around wild as ever. He was afraid to hold it. I don't blame him. So I took that picture. Just look at how beautiful that fish is. I want to eat some fish for supper. You want to eat some fish for supper? Yeah, eat some calamari. Uh, like a calamari. <laughs> some breakfast. <laughs> That's a pura squid, guys. That's pura squid. Yeah, yeah, bro, yeah, bro, pura squid. The white balls is the legal balbara. It's a, it's a thick skin one. It's the one you tell in the restaurant. Yeah. yeah. Now they call it white gold because also the crew, when they go fishing, they, they say they're going for white gold because they're going out to see each crew member catches a ton of this. It's getting paid, you can say, five, five, six grand. Huh? Yeah. Four days work. Yeah. Uh, I'm going to catch a fish in the dark. squid. Is it on lines or? Yeah, hand line, eh? Okay. Yeah, all, this, all the chopper yeah. gets caught with hand line. And you'll catch a ton of them. Yeah, you catch a lot. So when, when, they, when they're there, they're under your boat. You catch them day yes. and night, non stop. I thought, I thought they put nets and things catching the squid. Yeah. So I saw a YouTube video the other one day where they catch them. One black guy, just like this. Just take a line and turn what they put Then he's got, got 10 lines. One, 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 one guy, got 10 like different lines. Up the yeah. squids, uh. One guy fishes with 10 different lines like this, pulling chopper. I've seen it like that down there in uh, East London. It's almost... See, they tell us, they tell me I promise you gotta put a piece of gold on your head. I promise you, I promise you. No, 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 Yeah, it's not very good.
Everyone was saying I'm gonna be seasick, seasick. I'm fine, check this, I'm at sea. <laughs> oh, kijk die bliksem om weer donder slim. Ach, zei, a few moments later. Hey, roep weer van George! Okay, here we go, boy. In your bucket. Take this knob over here. And wine. Wine. Wine up, yeah. Wine up. Wine up, boy. Wine up, wine, wine up, wine up. Rod in the bucket. Okay, wine, 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 wine. And like a, okay, so what do you do? Yeah. Oh, yeah. Leave it outside, leave it outside. Leave it outside, outside. Get the product, get the product. This is too far, isn't it? Everyone's catching. Come on, Red. And that's the thing I was telling you about. Blue under the eye. Yeah, you see it's got a blue under the eye. We are seeing the fish, wine, we are seeing the fish, wine. Wine, wine, almost. Another five wines in its year. <laughs> Do you understand, Jethro? You're fine. Almost, yeah, boy. Come on, come on, come on. Alright, wine, 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 wine. Come on, stop. Come closer to me. Oh, Jethro. Too real. Good work, go my way. Alright, here we go. Oh, Jethro. I got two fish at once. Daddy Jeff! Wine, 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 wine! Wine, 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 wine! You're gonna like this color on this fish. Yeah, you're gonna like the color on this fish. Okay, slowly we have a Ah, that's good. Wow, that's good. Wow, that's good. Wow, that's good. Nice, longer line. Alright, there's an Englishman boy. Englishman. Irishman. Yeah, we don't. Yeah, you know. Broken fish. That's all. Now you see, you get an Englishman, you get a Scotch. Where's the burki? You'll never. Like, like, guys. So this is our trigger fish from Shelly Beach. If you look at the trigger over there, it can't go back. You can press as hard as you want. It's like a gun. You just take the trigger over there. Whoop. Press the trigger, and then the pin goes flat there. Trigger mm. fish.
there we go. Otherwise it stays up there, it can't go down. Small little trigger over there, poop, and goes down. Trigger fish on Shady Beach. There we are, oh, Jeffrey, sorry man, that's a, that's a brother, oh nice fish, nice fish. Oh, like a vein. Like a vein. We on the ground going up. It's your color. It's your color. It's your color. It's your color. Will I do it again? Yes, and I will. <laughs> will you take your children again? <laughs> will I take my children again? No, until they're old enough to be patient enough. <laughs> uh, <laughs> but we caught some good fish and uh, we're gonna eat good enough. fish tonight. Yeah, no doubt. I'm happy about that. It was a good experience, definitely. Um, definitely, I definitely like to do that again. Get the bigger fish. Special, just like you know, this plain old uh, fashion butter garlic mix. I'm gonna put some onions in, in this just for flavor. And uh, actually, what I should have done was I should have put some red sauce on first. Yeah, and that would be this. Uh, check this out. Here we have a garlic sauce made with butter. Ooh, let me just stir that up a little bit. It's not supposed to look like so nasty. Mm, there we go. Mm, nice. Yes. So, 
Okay, let me just pour this right up in here. Quick and fast. There's plenty of garlic in there, huh? Yeah, yeah. You can always put more garlic. It's, you can't go wrong. More you garlic, the better. Wrong. Right, let me just put a little bit in here. Ginger, ah, oh, nice. Ginger is always awesome with the fish. Mm. Throw a slice of lemon in there as well, huh? Slice of lemon, eh? Mm. Yeah. Slice, lemon. one or two slices of lemon. Yeah, thank you. Let's get the if you have some fresh herbs, chuck them in there as well. Whole, yeah. whole doesn't even matter. Herbs? Yeah, didn't yeah, you have some there? Oh, they all, they all chopped them. <laughs> so, yeah. No, it's fine. Pepper. I thought you had some fresh herbs. Are they all gone? Fresh herbs. Oh yeah, chuck some of that fresh stuff in there. Are already in the search? Yeah, but it's always handy to throw a bit of fresh stuff on top of it as well. Perfect. Coriander. Coriander, we're going very really Asian with this then, huh? Ginger, coriander, lovely. Oh no, the pot is finished. No, yep, that's fine. And coriander coriander will be great, plenty, huh? Yeah, nice. That'll cook up that's awesome. About it. So, let me just make sure I've got it all. Oh, mm -hmm. Some little bit there. Yeah. Put some in this head here. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Good, good. Garlic, mm. it's gonna be so nice. Mm -hmm. Let's pour some on this, on this bed. Mm. That shouldn't be hot. There's your gloves. Sure, we're gonna need more sauce. <laughs> Lovely. Now, we need uh, just a small bow. Bow, aluminium bow. Have you seen an aluminium bow before? It looks something mm. like this. Mm. This. this is it. This is it. Mm-hmm. Very good. This is it. Here we go, the moment of truth. Mm, yeah. I think I should have put uh, gravy on the outside, but I think it might, it might have been too busy. That'll be fine, yeah. So let's just keep it like this. Anyway, I want to get rid of that. Oh, that just feels so good. <laughs> we caught that. <laughs> And now we're gonna cook it <laughs> and it's gonna taste so good mm. out here in Durban. Couldn't have had it any other way. <laughs> okay, here we go. Nicely, nicely. Let's put him on the pride. It's tasty. Just like this. Ooh, yeah. Mmm, nice. On the hot. 
on the hot coast. Oh, that is so good. Mm. Oh, that is so nice. Oh. <laughs> Owen, you got to come try this. Mm, 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 mm. Oh, I think it's ready. It's ready. I got to take it off right now. You reckon it's done? Yeah, this is this is totally. Oh, that's the. Yeah, the slinger. The slinger is tasting real good. I'm put some more pasting on it. This will keep. So I don't dry it out there. Okay, this is definitely done. I gotta take it off. Oh, look at that presentation right there. That is presentation right there. Hmm? Presentation on the poiki pot lid. Oh, that is beautiful. We managed to get some nice big crayfish from our new fisherman friends and we prepared them on the fry as well. No doubt we'll be having a seafood feast tonight what under the full this? moon with the sound of the waves breaking mm. on the beach. So relaxing. Three minutes on the timer. Get it. Uh, let's squeeze some lemon, mm. some salt and pepper. Happy days. I'm gonna sample this one right now. Oh, oh that looks so good. Yeah, and then we'll throw them on top. And then we'll just throw it. Looking good, looking real good. I'm make sure those ones are cooked back there. How is it looking here? I think so. I'm gonna overdo it. 
Mmm, it's actually, it's almost ready. Almost ready. It's always an adventure, Yeah, you don't want to share with me. Yeah, I, I just want to taste actually. Oh, check this. Just, just taste. Oh, this has got to be the best fish you've if ever tasted. He was tasted. saying this thing, you got to pull fish the fish? head. Huh? This is a Scotsman. This is oh, a Scotsman? So let's pull the head off. Oh, it's so hot. <laughs> 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 you should have caught it there on camera too. <laughs> Is it ready? Mm. That's ready. It's very ready. Check this. Check this. This thing just breaks off. The... Ooh. Ooh. We need. We need. Uh, we need something else. Uh, yeah. Let's put it in here. Okay. Mm -hmm. Just for the time being, I'm going to put it there. So I'm going to put all the fins in there. There we go. In the head. The head. The head. But the head is hard, bro. I can't touch this Use thing. Use the too knife hard. and a fork, bro. You're in Chandra. Yeah, man. You see, you gotta, you gotta handle this thing in Chandra. This is quite easy. That's all. I'm just gonna eat that. I'm gonna eat that. Ooh. Yes, this head stuff. Ooh. Check this meat up. Check this meat Cheekbone. Not in cheekbone. Is that how you eat? I don't know. Ooh, it's actually nice. Is it? I've never had it. Mmm. There's an eye chicken. So many tools. Stop. It is true what they say. The best fish is fresh fish. It was delicious. Good food with good company and finished off with a nice bottle of white wine that my wife had been keeping for almost eight years. And I think this was a special enough occasion to pop that bottle. This one is one for the books and I'm so glad we have this video as a memory. If you've made it this far, you're a real one and I'd like to thank you for your support. I'd also like to send a shout out to Mighty Fishing Charters for that wonderful fishing experience. I'd also like to send a shout out to my good friend Chatterjee for producing the music in this video. Absolutely love your music and I'm so privileged to have your support in this channel. Thank you. All the links are in the description below if you're interested in checking them out. And as always, until next time, Remember, good things come to those who bait. Salute! Yeah,